All right, so I'd like to start off with a question, guys. How many of you, from any, from any point in your life, have played a sport? Whether that be in football, basketball, all the way to band, cheer, something like that. So a pretty good number, right? So my topic today is the positive effects of sports and youth development. So here are my reasons for it. Um, so they're beneficial because of the benefits from physical health, mental health, and also um, the boost in communication and social skills. So we'll start with the physical health. Um, sports increase physical activity and physical fitness resulting in lower obesity rates from children not participating in some type of sport. Um, so that kind of speaks for itself. Like it really, um, kids are active, they're kind of doing stuff and that's, they're obviously gonna be a little bit more in shape than some of those kids who just aren't um, participating in those activities. So um, studies have found significant differences in waist circum circumference. Um, BMI, which is your body mass index, and then peak oxygen intake levels, um, favoring those kids who don't participate. So that study comes from the Scandinavian, yeah, so the Scandinavian Journal of Medicine and Sci Science and Sports. So now let's go to the mental health, um, kind of like that. So sports offer higher amounts of stimulation, which leads directly to higher mental awareness and faster development. <coughs> And then the more time spent in participating in sports has linked to higher interpersonal skills and fewer internalizing problems. So interpersonal skills and strengths are like communicating. So that's outside of like one-on-one, -on -one, like kind of speaking with other kids and kind of communicating, interacting with those kids compared to just kind of staying with yourself. And then internalizing problems. So that's really like expressing yourself, kind of just um, ex like, yeah, expressing yourself and kind of just speaking in general. So. That study comes from the Journal of Sports and Exercise Psychology. Come on, man. All right, so let's go to the communication and the social skills. Sports require teamwork and communication, enabling low pressure communication and effective dialogue possibilities. So sports really, um, as kids, like sometimes you see those kids that just really have problems getting out of their show, really speaking to others and kind of um, like expressing themselves. So sports offer more of a low pressure circumstance and more of a low pressure like um, enabling them to really talk and communicate other than just being straight like, hey, I'm Sam. <laughs> so according to the Journal of Sports and Exercise Psychology, sport, or sports, whether in school or out of school, positively link to perception of competence. Um, and that only helps as they age. So a counter argument. So the biggest argument kind of against kids playing sports or kind of participating in sports is that it's a waste of time. They think that they maybe can use that time to really like do more kind of learning stuff or other developmental things like um, certain courses or certain things like that. So, but really um, my kind of counter to that is sports have taught me personally so many life lessons that to this day I still kind of take with me and um, can hang my hat on if you will. Um, compared to like those kids who didn't like especially like hard work and um, like determination like really getting through things like those are sometimes some, some assignments that I'm like probably if I didn't play sports I wouldn't be so prone to kind of get done and kind of being like no you're you gotta get you can get through this you can kind of get um, that done and so I would like to credit sports to kind of that uh, that philosophy all right, so my conclusion, sports are an essential part of early childhood development and should be experienced by every child to some degree, whether that's just trying them out. If you don't like them, you don't like them. There's, there's nothing wrong with that. But I think every kid should at least try some type of sport, whether it being you know a real complex sport, football, baseball, or even like band or kind of like cheerleading, where it's not so much a um, kind of physical contact, if you will. So, um, and then of course my reason is again, sports are important the youth development because of the benefits to physical health, mental health, and use of communication skills. All right, there's my references and sources. All right, you guys.